Count by tens to 120, lesson 6.2. When we count by tens, the number in the tens place will go up. The ones place will stay the same. If we split a number into tens and ones, the number on the left is the tens place, the number on the right is the ones place. These are the tens, and the zeros are in the ones place. We count by tens, and each number in the tens place goes up by one more. One, two, three, four. The number in the ones place stays the same. We have 10, 20, 30, 40. We look at a hundred chart, and we can see all the tens coming down this column. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. All the tens are going up by one, and the ones place is staying a zero. We can see the pattern. We can start at 10 and count by tens. Each number will be 10 more than the last number. 20 is 10 more than 10. 30 is 10 more than 20. Coming down the column, each number is 10 more than the number before it. We could start at any number and count by tens. We could start at 4. All the 1's place will stay a 4, and the 10's place will go up by 10. 4, 14, 24, 34, 44. See how the 10's are going up? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. See the pattern? And each number will be 10 more than the last number. 34 is 10 more than 24. The 10's will go up. The ones will stay the same. We have a 4 for our starting number. 10 more would be 14. We now have 110. We had no 10s here. Now we have 110. The next number would be 24. Now we have two 10s. The ones place is staying a 4. Then we have three 10s, and the ones place stays the same. Then we have four 10s, and the ones place stays the same. That would be counting by tens, starting with four. We can use a chart to help us. We find the first number on the chart, and then we go down one row. All the numbers going sideways are in rows. The numbers coming down are in columns. So what is 10 more than 37? We look for 37 on the chart. Here's the 30s. There's 37. We go down 1, and it's 47. The tens place went up to a 4, and the ones place stayed the same. What's 10 more than 53? We find 53 on the chart. Here's the 50s. There's 53. We go down one row, and it's 63. The tens place went up to a 6, and the ones place stayed the same. 99. What is 10 more than 99? We find the 99 on the chart. Here's the 90s. There's 99. And 10 more would be 109. The 9 went up to a 10 in the 10s place. And the, this 9 in the 1s place stays the same. It's 109. We go from 99 to 109. What about 102? We find 102 on the chart. Here it is. We go down one row. We have 112. You can think of it like this is a 10, and the next one would be an 11. And the ones place stays the same as a 2. The tens place went up by 1. It went from a 0 to a 1. And the ones place stayed the same. And look. This number in the hundreds place stayed the same also, didn't it? What number is 10 less than 61? We find the 61 on the chart. There it is. And we're going 10 less, so we're going to go up a row to 51. 10 less 
would be one smaller for the tens place. So it would be a five, and the ones place stays the same. What number is 10 less than 17? We find the 17, and we go up one row. It's a seven. If we take a 10 away from here, we're taking away this 110, so we just have a 7. What number is 10 less than 113? We find the 113 on the chart, and we go up one row. It's 103. The 1's place stayed a 3, and the 10's place went from a 1 to a 0. What number is 10 less than 120? We find the 120 on the chart, and we go up one row. It's 110. The number in the tens place became one smaller. The 100 stayed the same. The number in the tens place became one smaller, so it's a 1. That's one smaller than 2. And the, ten, and the ones place stays the same, so it's 110. If we start on 26 and count on by tens, what number is after 56 and before 76? We find 26 on the chart. Here it is. And we need to find a number that is after 56. Here it is. But it's before 76. So the number that's after 56 and before 76 would be... 66. We have 26, 36, 46, 56, 66, whoops, got to make my 6 better, 76. So 66 is the number after 56 and the number before 76. If we start on 45 and count on by tens, what number is after 95 and before 115? So we find 45 on the chart. Here it is. And we look for 95. There it is. So we need a number that's after 95 and before 115. It's after 95 and it's before 115. Do you see the number that's in between here? It's 105. If we made our list of numbers, we start on 45, and the tens are going to go up. Then we have 55. 65, 75, 85, 95, 105, 115. And the 105 is after the 95, and it's before the 115. See? And the chart can help us. So remember that the tens go up and the ones stay the same. We can match each number on the left, the green ones, to a number on the right, the orange ones, that is 10 more. What number is 10 more than 28? Do you see an orange box number that is 10 more than 28? Remember, the ones place is going to stay the same and the tens are going to go up by one. If you said 38, you're right. The ones are the same, and the number in the tens place went up by one more. What's 10 more than 71? If you said 81, you're right. The tens went up by one, and the ones place stayed as a one. What number is 10 more than six? If you said 16, you're right. The ones place stays a 6, and we added a 10. There were zero tens. Now there's one 10. And the only one left is 102 and 112. 
And that is 10 more, and the 1 stayed the same. The numbers in the tens place will go up. The numbers in the ones place will stay the same. If we're starting at 12, the numbers in the tens place will go up. 2, 3, 4, 5. The ones place stays the same. So we have 12, then 22, 32, 42, 52, 62, 72, 82, 92, 102, 112. If we're starting at 84, the tens will go up one and the ones will stay the same. We'll have 84, 94, 104, 114. If we're starting at 35, the tens will go up one. See? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And the ones are staying a 5. We have 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 105, 115. So you can count by tens starting at any number. Our next lesson is understand tens and ones. That's lesson 6.3. Can you count by tens? Can you count by 10 starting with 10? How far can you go? You should try it. I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.